Hey everyone, it's Lauren from Our Hiding Place, and um, this is my first weblog, so welcome. Um, as you know, we just flew in from Barcelona, Spain last night, so I'm completely exhausted, have a ton of laundry, cleaning, grocery shopping, dry cleaning, and all of that stuff to do, but I really wanted to do this video to show you a really great travel tip I discovered um, right before we were leaving. Um, if you're anything like me, you have an obsession with necklaces and big earrings and probably have way too many to the point where it could be kind of considered hoarding. Yeah. And you might also have trouble meeting that 50 pound limit because you feel it's absolutely necessary to bring every single piece of jewelry you own on vacation with you. So if that is you, this tip here today is for you. Um, so, and pretty much anyone can do it. It involves a very simple household item that everyone has, a Ziploc baggie. Unless, of course, you're against plastic, um, to which I can't help you. Um, but if you aren't, then this tip is for you. So basically, I have some necklaces here, as you can see. Um, some that I brought on trip with me, and some I actually didn't wear on trip, but um, and all you really do is stick one of the necklaces in the bag. Not that much, so you're leaving that much chain out. And you zip it. If you can. zip shut. So that one's in there pretty good. Then you can take another one and do the same thing. Leaving a little bit of the chain out. Making sure it's zipped again so it's in there securely. And then the last one. Again, a little bit of that chain sticking out and zip it again. So basically all these sides here, here, here are zipped shut. Your necklaces are hanging in there. So now what you do is you just very gently fold or roll the bag in. There you go. And that's it. Um, I like to kind of put them in between my clothes so that um, they don't really shift around while traveling. And this just basically solves that problem of throwing your necklaces in your suitcase and you know opening it up after your flight and seeing that they've developed into some giant big ball of chain that you then spend like way longer than you really want to trying to undo. So I use this twice so far. Um, on the way to Spain and on the way back from Spain and it really worked and it's cost effective it's not costing you anything it's not adding any extra weight to your luggage and it does the trick so um, by all means if you have any other advice on how to um ooh, sorry that's my dog um any other advice on how to um you know travel with your necklaces so they're not getting tangled please leave me a comment below because I'm always looking for great ways um, to make packing a little bit easier because I can't stand it. Um, and just for anyone else who reads to um, anything, any kind of advice you might have for uh, travel tips. So um, I hope you guys are having a great Monday so far. And I'm going to go and do everything that I probably should have had done while we were gone last week. I have a lot of catching up to do. Um, so I hope you guys have a great rest of the week. And thanks for hanging out with me.